there's nothing as raw as a youtube 3 a.m video those are the best kind of youtube videos that came into existence that's been viewed upon millions upon millions of kids and adults people of all ages because why it's scary it's really scary oh my god guys i'm gonna drink the omega sauce potion at 3 a.m and it's supposedly gonna turn me into the imposter and i wanted to make a 3 a.m video sometime i don't know when maybe i'm still gonna do it because me and a friend talked about it like five six years ago so the guy who got me into 3 a.m videos was in 2017 2018 2019 i think and i used to be scared because this guy's videos were actually good back then so I'm just gonna watch them and maybe talk about it. But the guy that I watched was called Jesse Baron, but it turned it into Jester. He used to have some class. I don't know if it's still. Some of his videos were iffy and funny. He had series like Zozo, the strongest demon or whatever, captured him and he had to be rescued. One of my favorite series were the Jeff the Killer one and the Almo 3am videos. Me and my friend used to watch it every time he came over up until the Potion 3am videos. We didn't really like it because it wasn't as entertaining. <gasps> this potion can turn you into an evil Mickey Mouse. Yeah, that, that just wasn't our type for the 3am videos. After we watched less of Jesse's content, we went to Mike's videos because he had like 20 to 40 minute long videos about stuff that were more real. Like going to the most haunted place in California or something like that. But those were interesting because it was more relatable than calling Jeff Bezos at 3 a.m. Oh, no, no, no ads, no ads. Yo, what is up you guys? On tonight's video, we ordered the Among Us potion <laughs> from the dark web. <laughs> and supposedly, when you drink this Among Us potion at 3 a.m., you turn into the imposter from among us and we're gonna find out if it actually is real or if it's not and it better be real you guys because i literally spent five hundred dollars <gasps> and 69 cents whoa five hundred dollars and 69 cents that's outrageous obviously as you guys know this is real this is a real video this happened in real life because as you can see Oh my word! What oh my word, he's there! Okay. Oh! Get up away from me! Oh. No, run away, run away! Oh my god! And then one person is gonna be kidnapped and they're gonna save them the next video the next day because they're gonna be captured in the 3 a.m. dimension. Oh. Is this the Elmo customer service number? <laughs> Oh, no, guys, Elmo? Guys, no, no. Take it. What do you mean? What's good, Jesters? Hope you guys are doing super well. Tonight, I'm going to be attempting to call Elmo on FaceTime at 3 a.m. Now, the reason for this is because if you guys... Have okay, maybe he was not as good as I remembered he was. This one wasn't creepy. I remember one night... I just, I just put the video off and just closed my eyes sometimes because I was a little baby bitch back in the day. Am I still a baby bitch? I don't know. I haven't played a horror game in a long time because I'm a baby bitch. Maybe I'm not anymore. So in his golden days, he went to a trampoline park and some kind of gym for his videos. And this shit was absolutely fire to watch. Stop, man. Don't play games like that. The only way your viewers are going to be safe is we knew the videos were fake especially the parts when they go like the only way you'll be safe is if you like and subscribe this video i haven't smiled this much in a long time especially since the crippling depression i got by watching the first half of the rick and morty anime but my boy jesse looked good 
and for some random lore his phone number got leaked in a video he they forgot to censor it and he got so many calls and then it changed it right here that I can see the entire place but not only that I'm sitting on the throne now so I put him in my phone and I am ready to watching this is making me so happy it's just it's so nostalgic to me it's more nostalgic than my own birth really hoping he answers guys but I, I honestly I have no idea I don't know what to expect I've got him calling guys <sighs> Oh my god, yo, look, guys, what the hell? Hello? Jeff. Yo, guys, what the hell? Hey man, how's it going? <laughs> what I assume is they probably got some random guy sleeping with his McDonald's fries laying on the ground next to him and just said, Oh, uh, you want some easy money? Yeah. We need you to dress up as a serial killer from a creepypasta and uh, then we'll pay you like $10 max. My name's Jesse. I make YouTube videos. I, I'm just making a video calling you at 3am. Is that okay? No way guys. It's not. As every normal person with morals and just a loving nature, he asked for permission. He couldn't talk to him earlier, so he called him and said, can I make a video about calling you? Are you fine with me calling you? And then, then Jeff said no. Guys, we're gonna find out if Jesse lost his social status over this. Is he gonna A, stop the call, or B, keep on bothering Jeff the Killer? Or C, Jeff the Killer is like, you called me already. Mm. That's not okay? Mm. Where are you right now? How far are you? Mm. Hmm. What? How far am I? You caught me in the middle of jerking off. After I'm done with this, and it's still 3 a.m., I'm gonna come after you, and I'm gonna make you pay for ruining my me time. Down below? I don't, I don't understand, guys. What? Oh, no. No. You're... You're lying. There's no freaking way, guys. What? Jesse! What do you want from me? Jesse literally has an endoskeleton behind him from Five Nights at Freddy's. And Jeff the Killer is just showing a green screen, obviously. So Jesse is fine. He is nowhere to be seen. For a moment, I thought he wasn't jacking off. He was just, just venting like the among us imposter what do you want from me why are you here how did you get here the doors are locked you don't talk <laughs> it sounds like he's undulating he just gotta say some words he acting like he's broly from dragon ball z guys what the f <laughs> okay, hey man I don't, I don't mean any harm okay i was just calling you on facetime uh, <laughs> can i can i go I'm coming for you. No. Stop, man. Don't play games like that. The only way your viewers are going to be safe is if they subscribe. I know you're not going to do anything, man. Guys, do, do I freaking leave? What do I do? I did not expect to watch six minutes of this video, but I don't know. It's either the nostalgia or the suspense that's killing me because I got to see what's going to happen. I need to see what's in store for us in this video, but I think I, I won't be able to finish it because I've cursed myself with and not liking and subscribing. He's still gonna go after Jesse, but then he's gonna be after me next. Oh, I just, just wanted to talk about the 3am videos. Uh, I'm maybe gonna watch it and talk about it again because I find it funny. And it's just fun to re-watch this. Like and subscribe or comment if you want to see that. Uh, uh, uh.